You're about to see one of the tastiest and easiest cinnamon roll recipe ever. First the dough. In a large bowl, take 500 ml of warm milk, then sugar, then melted butter, and dry yeast. Then give it a good mix. In 8 to 10 minutes, yeast will be bloomed if everything was right until now. And then add the flour. Mix it really well until all the ingredients are nicely incorporated. Then cover with a cling film and let it rise for an hour. While the flour is rising, we'll finish all the other preparations in this time. First the filling. For that, light brown sugar, some ground cinnamon, and softened butter. Make sure the butter is soft at room temperature, so they mix together without too much effort. Once that is done, we will make the frosting. For that, we need vanilla extract, melted butter, half cup of milk, half cup cream cheese, then give it a good mix. After that, add the powdered sugar bit by bit and keep mixing as you see in the video. Once that is done, we butter the baking tray and keep it ready for later. Okay, meanwhile the dough has risen really well. Now it's time to add another cup of flour, some salt and baking powder. Then start mixing in the bowl and then transfer it on the table. Kneading at the beginning it may be hard but keep kneading until you get that beautiful soft dough texture. Then simply dust the table and start rolling the dough gently. Don't roll it too thin, knead it too thick, roughly about 1 cm. Next, spread all the sugar cinnamon butter mixture on the dough and spread it evenly. Then start rolling from one side and carefully roll it until the end. To cut the cinnamon roll, you may use dental floss or baking knife. It doesn't make any huge difference. And make sure to cut them equal pieces so they all bake at the same time. Next, place the cinnamon roll on the baking tray and let it proof for another one hour. This step is must to make the cinnamon rolls soft and puffy. After one hour, bake the cinnamon rolls in a preheated oven at 180 degrees Celsius temperature, which takes roughly about 25 to 30 minutes. Once they have nice color, just take out the cinnamon rolls and let them cool down for about 10 minutes. After 10 minutes, add those yummy frosting as you wish, as much or as little as you like. But before you go, please hit the like button and I will see you with another nice recipe in the next video.